This week's hometown hero is positively Wisconsin. This Door County veteran cares about the environment. He got smoking banned in the Sebastopol School District years ago and has received numerous awards for his efforts. Local 5's Nate Stewart talked to the 90-year-old about how he also proudly served our country during World War II. It's a great, great community, this Sebastopol community. And Carl Schulz has given back to the area in a big way, but he's also given back to his country when he enlisted with the Army back in 1945 at just 17 years old. It was just part of the, our blood and our family. His father, Philip, was a private in the infantry during World War I, who also earned the Purple Heart. In fact, he was the last doughboy to uh, leave Europe. He was at a hospital in in London. Carl first went through a special army training consisting of everything they needed to know to prepare for the invasion of Japan. From cryptography to, to radio to light machine gun uh, and mortars and bazookas and everything. And he was soon jumping out of airplanes as a paratrooper with the 11th Airborne. Oh, I didn't know that that was part of the program. He was then sent overseas, but those skills would be set aside after the U.S. dropped the atomic bomb over Hiroshima, damage that Carl witnessed firsthand. It looked like uh, the uh, damaged forest areas that we see today. It was nothing uh, that was uh, identified. After serving two years, Carl's time with the Army was done, but he never stopped giving back. He was the superintendent of the Sevastopol School District for 34 years. People are very tolerant. <laughs> and he's the founder of The Farm off Highway 57 in Door County. It's a very interesting uh, uh, facility and a, a major attraction for Door County. And he describes his service to our country as a rewarding one. A lot of camaraderie. Got to uh, know a lot of great people. Amazing man. Thank you, Carl, for your service. If you'd like to nominate someone from your community to be featured in our Hometown Hero segment, just email Nate at the address on your screen.